quarters of a pizza. Let's work it out. We're going to add them all together right now. Just the last two. Let's check if that's equivalent to one hole. Yes, it is. Papa that's Michael, please know we have one hole of pizza. That's great, but you need to show you were looking now. So, so since we need four, four, four slices of pizza, it, so we're going to have four, 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 four slices. So that that is equivalent to one whole because it's because the, the numerator is the, is the exact same as the denominator. I'm kind of hungry. Can we please have your first? Uh, okay, but you have to do it mathematically. All right. So let's so let's add them up. But we got, but well, it's one third, but we got one more. So then it, it equals one whole and one third. What are you working for? Do it, you're working out. So basically, since the, we're doing it in thirds, you put three at the denominator. But then since there's four people, you put four as the numerator. But isn't that too much? So three thirds is one whole, but there's one third left over, so that would equal one whole and one third. So can we have one whole and one third of um, pizza without bread? Uh, can we have 